Okay, now let's see what is pedal triangle and more specifically orthic triangle. Consider triangle ABC. Here we have triangle ABC. Now there is point P in the plane of ABC. This point P may be either inside triangle or outside triangle or on the triangle. Okay. Consider point P here inside triangle. Now from point P draw perpendiculars on the sides. Okay. We have here perpendiculars from point P on the sides. We have fit of perpendiculars uh, D, E and F. Okay. Then triangle formed by these feet of perpendiculars is called pedal triangle. We have here triangle D, E, F. This triangle is called pedal triangle. In special case when point P is orthocenter, then uh, this pedal triangle is called orthic triangle. So, orthic triangle is one special pedal triangle in which point P is ortho center of triangle. In our syllabus, we have a pedal triangle with respect to ortho center only. There is only one pedal triangle. Okay, so we call orthic triangle a pedal triangle. Okay, now orthic triangle ko hi pedal triangle kehte hain. Now here we have acute angle triangle ABC in which H is ortho center. D, E, F are fit of perpendiculars from ortho center on sides B, C, A, C, and A, B respectively. Okay, so triangle formed by these feet of perpendiculars is called pedal triangle or more specifically orthic triangle. हम generally word pedal triangle use करेंगे, ठीक है ना? Now let's get sides and angles of pedal triangle. Okay, now do you see some sets of uh, four concentric points in this figure? Definitely there are many. Points B, F, H, D are concentric. ये चार points जो हैं वो concentric हैं ना, ठीक है? Then what will be this angle? For this angle we consider chord F, H. Chord F, H will subtend same angle at point D and at point B, ठीक है ना? इन दोनों points पे chord F, H same angle subtend करेगा because points B, F, H, D are now what is this angle? For this angle we consider right angle triangle AEB. This angle is 90, this angle is A. So this angle is 90 minus A. So this angle is also 90 minus A. Okay. Now let us get this angle. Now points D, H, E, C are concyclic. Okay. Here, for points B, F, H, D, uh, B, H will be diameter because B, H is subtending right angle at point F and at point D. So, these four points are concyclic, what will be B, H? Kya ho jayega? Diameter will be diameter. Similarly here, points D, H, E, C are concyclic in which H, C is diameter. Okay? Then what will be this angle? This angle will be equal to this angle and this angle is uh, 90 minus A from triangle A, F, C. Uh, this angle is 90, this angle is A, so this angle is 90 minus A, that means this angle is also 90 minus A. Okay? Now this is altitude of triangle ABC through vertex A, which is actually angle bisector of uh, angle D in triangle DEF. This is internal angle bisector of angle D because these two angles are equal. Okay? तो ट्रायंगल का जो अल्टीट्यूड है वर्टेक्स ए से वो इस ट्रायंगल में एंगल डी का इंटरनल एंगल बाइसेक्टर हो जाएगा ठीक है ना सिमिलरली वी कैन गेट दिस टू एंगल्स ओके वी हैव पॉइंट्स ए एफ एच ई व्हिच आर कॉन्साइक्लिक इन व्हिच ए एच इज डायमीटर दिस एंगल विल बी 90 माइनस बी एंड दिस एंगल विल बी आल्सो 90 माइनस बी this angle will be 90 minus C and uh, this also 90 minus C. Okay. That means uh, this altitude is internal angle bisector of angle E and this altitude of triangle ABC is internal angle bisector of angle F in triangle DEF. That means ortho center of triangle ABC is in center of triangle DEF. Okay, 
Here lines AD, B and CF are altitudes of triangle ABC. So, point H is ortho center of triangle ABC. But these lines are actually internal angle bisectors of triangle DEF. Okay. And internal angle bisectors meet at a point uh, which is in center of triangle. Okay, right? ट्राइंगल के जो इंटरनल एंगल बाइसेक्टर्स हैं वो कहाँ पे मिलते हैं इन सेंटर में मिलते हैं दैट मीन्स ऑर्थो सेंटर ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए बी सी इज इन सेंटर ऑफ ट्राइंगल डी एफ इन सेंटर ऑफ पेडल ट्राइंगल ऑर्थिक ट्राइंगल दिस इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट फाइंडिंग्स ओके ना वी हैव एंगल्स ऑफ पेडल ट्राइंगल लेट्स गेट द साइड्स ओके लेट्स गेट साइड एफ डी ओके For FD, we consider triangle FBD. बी हम ट्राइंगल कंसिडर करते हैं एफ बी डी इन दिस ट्राइंगल दिस इज प्रोजेक्शन ऑफ ए बी ऑन बी सी विच इज सी कॉस बी एंड बी एफ इज प्रोजेक्शन ऑफ बी सी ऑन ए बी विच इज एक्चुअली ए कॉस बी ओके नाउ हेयर वी हेर टू साइड एंड इंक्लूडेड एंगल दिस एंगल इज बी वी कैन फाइंड साइड एफ डी यूजिंग कुसाइन रूल ठीक है so using cosine rule we have fd square is equal to square of this side a square cos square b plus square of this side c square cos square b okay minus 2 multiplied by a cos b c cos b multiplied by cos of included angle which is b so we have here a uh, multiply by cos b okay now we have now we have cos square b common from these three terms so inside bracket we have a square plus c square minus 2 ac cos b now from cosine rule this is b square so we have fd square is equal to b square cos square b so fd is equal to b cos b that means uh, side of pedal triangle opposite to angle b is b cos b uh, similarly uh, side of pedal triangle opposite to angle a will be a cos a. here fe is equal to a cos a and uh, side opposite to angle c will be c cos a. here length ed is equal to c cos c so here we have sides of pedal triangle okay now let's find circum radius of pedal triangle suppose circum radius is r dash okay how we get circum radius of any triangle for that we need uh, one side and uh, opposite angle here we have all the sides and all the angles okay so using sine rule in triangle def we have length uh, fe upon sine of angle edf this is equal to 2 multiplied by r dash where r dash is circum radius of triangle def okay now what is length fe Length FE is a cos a. Okay, what is angle EDF? Angle EDF is one uh, eighty degree minus two a. So we have here sine of one eighty degree minus two a. This is equal to two r dash. Okay. Now sine one eighty degree minus two a is sine two a. Sine two a is two sine a cos a. So we have a cos a upon Two sine a cos a. This is equal to two r dash. Here cos a gets cancelled out. A upon sine a is equal to two r. So this is equal to r. So we have two r dash is equal to r. That means r dash is equal to r upon two. That means circum radius of pedal triangle is half of the circum radius of parent triangle. Here parent triangle is triangle ABC. ठीक है ना? Now we have this results for acute angle triangle. Now suppose we have obtuse angle triangle ABC in which angle A is obtuse angle. So what we do here in this figure we replace ortho center H by vertex A and the vertex A by ortho center H. Here triangle ABC is obtuse angle in which this angle is obtuse. So ortho center is lying outside triangle. Here H is ortho center. ठीक है. DEF is pedal triangle or ऑर्थिक ट्राइंगल डी ई एफ आर फिट ऑफ परपेंडिकुलर्स फ्रॉम ऑर्थो सेंटर ऑन साइड्स ऑफ द ट्राइंगल इन दिस केस डिस्टेंस एफ ई विल बी माइनस ए कॉज ए ओके बिकॉज हियर एंगल ए इज ऑप्टिव सो वैल्यू ऑफ कॉज ए विल बी नेगेटिव 
So, here expression of F is followed by a minus sign. Expression for F D and E D will remain same. F D will be B cos B and E D will be C cos E because uh, angle B and C are acute angles. Okay, no? Now, here ortho center H will be X center of triangle D E F opposite to vertex. What is X center? Triangle has three X centers opposite to three vertices. This is X center opposite to vertex D. At X center opposite to vertex D, external angle bisectors of angles E and F and internal angle bisector of angle D intersect. ये जो X center है वहाँ पे external angle bisectors angles E and F के and internal angle bisector of angle D यहाँ पे intersect करेंगे. ठीक है ना? We will study X centers in detail in one of the coming videos. Okay. So here we have theory related to pedal triangle or orthic triangle. ठीक है ना?